many years now, it has been accepted that a student's personality type is linked to his or her learning skills. To train successfully, the instructor must learn to look for these different personality types. The extrovert, or E, processes information while talking, E, while the introvert, or I, processes information internally, I. The thinker, or T, makes decisions through cause and effect, T. The feeler, or F, uses the associative process in decision making, F. Most students are a combination of these different personality types. You might find an F-I-T-E or an I-F-E-T. The quicker professional trainers can spot these different personality types, the quicker they can convey the training information. In getting to know your students, look for these various personality types. For instance, here we have an SMTA or show me that again. No matter how many times you explain a process, they will always ask, Uh, yes, w would you show me that again? There's the IPBF, or I'm paralyzed by fear training. Just hit any key. Any key at all. How about the Y? That's a nice one. The IDNTC. I don't need this class. You know, I shouldn't even be here. Can you just tell me what's going to be on the exam? And the IWTL. I'm way too literal. Just type backslash, backslash, server name, backslash, file name. Uh, no. Stop. Stop typing. Take your hands off the keys. And perhaps the most challenging, the DAAP, dumb as a post. Is this the only channel? And so you see the classroom is filled with many unique personality types. To be able to spot them is to begin a journey in understanding the complex and fascinating mind of the trainee. Good luck.